Hey YouTube, this is Sean Gillum. Uh, again, I am Gillum, and today I will be talking to you about gear. Now, we're, we are obviously not in the military yet, but we want to. So we kind of get that lifestyle of getting a bunch of stuff that makes us feel like we are. So, I got this for my birthday, no, Christmas. Uh, last year, this is an ACU backpack. It's not a standard issue for the military, but it's almost it's almost there. Uh, let's get a closer view of this. So you've got just some small pockets. Here. Oh. <laughs> yeah, toy soldier in there. Dylan, I think that's yours. Uh, yeah, so this is um, Pretty good pockets. You got a uh, pretty good support back here. Get that in the camera. It's very strong with it. Goes all the way down the back. Uh, you got a small zipper here. A uh, big pocket here, and it goes all the way down. Regular pockets. It's it's basically that netting that you get on a normal backpack, school backpack. And yeah. Then you got the uh, adjustments here that hold it all together, the buckles. So it really shows and it'll get quite large. That's how big it could get. This is basically my school backpack, but on a weekend I'll uh, unload everything and I don't know, I'll put stuff in here. Like my next item, Camelback. It's a uh, the mini mule. If you can see right there, mini mule. Uh, this I I use it for a camelback basically, but it'll be in this back pocket here or in this top one here. Um, in here I'll obviously keep water and everything, and then I'll keep some medical supplies like tiny scissors, tweezers. I I usually have a bandana in there, and then. I'll put my gloves there, which are right here. I use workout gloves. I feel like they're the best for me. That's just what I like. And then in here, got National Guard, paracord bracelet, bandages, tourniquet, and like gauze and relief stuff, basically. Um, I like doing taking it on trails. I've got a boonie hat. My dad gave me this. Uh, this is a seven and one eight size. You can see it right there. Our, me and my dad both love these hats. All right. There you go. You can flip it up. Y'all, cowboy hat. Um. Yeah, I, I really like this hat. I love this hat. But sometimes you look stupid wherever you go. So there's that. Um, I'll bring out the my dive set in a minute, but I have an extra set of goggles since I want to be Tonda Dadder. Bungee cord usually uh, gets shoved through here. This latch on the camelback. And then I'll have a lot of uh, carabiners. Uh, attached stuff, rope and everything. My dad gave me this giant lock, so I like doing that. So, there's my main step. I'll go get my, di get my dive set. I will be right back. Alright, I'm back. Uh, here is my dive set. It's basically a snorkeling set, but that's what divers use. Kind of, they, you, if you're a diver, you've got the snorkel, you've got the mask, you've got the fins, all that. So this is uh, Tusa Sport. I like the bag. We got another carabiner on it. Uh, overall, amazing set. Goggles leak a little bit at the bottom. You just gotta maintain to clean them. Um, these are short fins. These are not actual dive fins. I've got a lot of crap, on, like residue, from the ocean. But the, yeah, these are short fins. These are not actual dive fins. My dad has a pair. Um.
but they do not fit me. Snorkel, you got that dry, and there so you go underwater, it's going to plug it. And I always like to keep it, uh, some rope, like nylon rope. I'll usually have this with that if I ever go out. But other than that, that is my gear. I used to have a full comp ACU uh, set. We got me and Shaw got them at Goodwill. It was about ten bucks per uniform, so it was actually a really good deal. I had some holes, not too big. Uh, it was like plugging a needle through it or a pencil. It's perfect. Um, yeah, I I, I kind of take them here. But uh, Shaw is holding it for me, hopefully, if he hasn't burned it or anything. But yeah, that's my gear. Um, comment on this video, like this video, favorite, and subscribe to show your support for our troops, alright? I, <clears throat> I am Gillum, and I am out. See you later, guys.